I have a mod going where we are kobolds, and I've I've built these hovels that we are living every that everything's being built into, and uh, we're similar to dwarves. We don't have the metalwork. We don't have the um, uh, this like this well the metalworking and smithing like like dwarves do. Uh, we're also more feeble. We're also a little bit cuter. Um, but most importantly, uh, we are very fragile. And I thought for something a little different, we would build something a little different. Uh, we have some spider pets. We got some snake pets. We have giant rat pets. We have some monitor lizard pets. Uh, uh, and also, we're doing a lot of building out of shells. We're using all our shells to make mostly everything. I think these walls over here, this whole, our whole barracks here is made out of shells. Um... Our um, a lot of our weapons and I think our I think our most of our armor is made out of shells as well. Uh, it's like Magic Draconis there is walking around with a couple babies, and we have 28 cobalts in this tent. We have no defense, and so if we get attacked, bad things are going to happen. We're going to die, basically. And uh, so the goal today is to is to build a defense. Um, I assumed wrongly that I th I think I was going to make it one day of this. I thought this was going to be a one day fort. We're going to get destroyed by uh, something. Dwarves or something. And it'd be all over. But we're still here. We haven't really had an attack. I don't think we have an attack at all, actually. Um, we do have an army. Uh, we've got an army of the the uh, the eviscerated confusion here. And we've done a lot of raiding. Uh, you can see some of us have weapons. we got some bows and, and well, some of us have weapons. Um, well, we've gone around. We've swiped a few things from, from uh, the neighbors. And we're mostly at peace with everyone around us, or they don't know who we are. Uh, there are a lot of towers there that are very angry with us. In fact, Cobalt Towers. Cobalt Towers. Now that's that's something to be looking forward to. That's something to achieve. <clears throat> Last month I had one thing. This month I have two things. What is next month? March. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Um, anyway, today, I think what I want to do today is, is get some sort of defense. So we've got this bridge going over our river here. I think what we need to do is we need to, we need to, uh, create a moat. We're going to, we're going to separate ourselves and, and, uh, cut ourselves off into an island. So we have at least water to stop us. Something, something comes flying in and won't stop anything. But we'll have some sort of a defense that we can fight on the bridges. We can get some cages stopping some things. And, um, well, we'll see where it goes from there. Uh, I, I think that, um... Our initial goal is to go around and just keep on stealing things because, well, we're kobolds and, and yeah, 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 some things you just can't stop. So I'm gonna go ahead and dig. Um, I'm not gonna go. I'm gonna channel like up up to the point, but not all the way to the uh, to the water there. I might as well connect up to that. Why not? And then we'll build the rest of it like over this way. I don't wanna. I wanna make sure we keep our mine inside, which is gonna be fine. Um, we'll top up some trees here, and we'll keep on... Well, we'll just kind of connect up these things here. And basically, run this thing around. Uh, actually, I shouldn't do that. I'll, I'll remove some of that stuff. Uh, um, and uh, we'll go and... Kind of build it around this way. There's a little pool there we can connect up. But I think I'm going to leave... I don't want to... I want to have a bit of a gap. So if we can get more buildings in, we've got room for it. So that's, that's my plan. Um... It's going to take them a little while to do this because we are just little kobolds. Something like that. And then and then from the river, we'll go, like, you know, over here and meet up with it. It might not be a bad idea to do something like, um, like a choke point of some kind. How would we do that? Could we, um... Wrong one. Can we maybe do like I think I think what I want to do is I'm thinking I'm going to cut a hole in this and have this like a road go through my inn and have a couple more buildings on this side. We can always cover that water up. But if this is going to be our spot, let's do something like that, and then uh, and do a little digging around and just have a a bit of a um, a bend in our river, and so things will have to kind of like come around to our bridge, and so we can kind of, like, stand here and shoot things. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but this... We're just going for something a little different. So we'll try that. We'll make sure we have enough gap here so that things don't... can't just jump over the water. Which they will do. 
So let's go ahead and make sure that isn't connected up because it'll flood everything. And that one. And we're just going to get the digging done first. And then we'll deal with everything else in a minute. And that's going to be just the, sort of the first level of digging. We've got to, we're going to have to do this a few, a few ways down. But we'll get started on that to get a bit of water going. And um, I think I'm going to change this thing around here, uh, this, this stockpile. And I'm going to edit it a bit. Maybe like separate it a bit like that. And we'll have a, like a road that goes through here. Like a road goes... This, this if anything, seems like a main building. It's that one, if you ask me. So uh, I think we'll have a road that goes through here and then have a few more buildings on the, over on this side. Is the uh, is sort of the plan. Um, so while well, that that's going to be happening, um, but oh, you know, speaking of, uh, I forgot. Uh, I had a request on on YouTube to um, to name uh, one of the most important of the kobolds with with uh, with a name, uh, Bingus. So we'll get ourselves a buttercup, and uh, yeah, <laughs> buttercup uh, uh, two. Hey, Harley, how's it going? <clears throat> we had Buttercup. We had Buttercup Jr., so we need, like, a Buttercup the third, or, um, something, something Buttercup. Butter, a Butter Spindle or something for our spider, as the game saves. Eventually, as the game saves. Silently. I noticed there's some fighting going on here, which I didn't notice. Uh, what? Well, maybe noticing a little too late. What is that? Oh, the cave rat's fighting. Okay. You do that. Uh, you, woolly spiderling. You can be the baby spider. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this is going to be Buttercup. Um. Nope. Yeah, enter. Got to put it down here, too. Um. Buttercup spiderling. There you go. Resist sickness and tough. That's the kind of spiders I would expect. Did it keep your name? Yeah, Buttercup Spiderling. Stray Buttercup Spiderling. Perfect. Butter mug. <laughs> okay, we got a scholar visiting us. I was thinking uh, last time, though, we didn't have any, really any visitors um, last time, did we? Yeah, we've had a, a, a lack of, of visitors, so I expect some more of that. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get a road started up. We're, um, we're going to do a little, little terraforming here. And put in a paved road and something like this. I'm gonna go through here just because it's kind of, kind of, kind of be kind of neat. We can make those roads out of shell. That's cool. Um, we have a lot of logs. We'll make all. I guess we we'll use the logs. I was in. Um, I was in Florida just about a month ago, and this may not be. This is this is not new for anyone that lives on the coast, but I was fascinated. I've seen this before in um, Virginia, but like around here, when you have gravel roads, it's just like, you know, little rocks. You throw a bunch of rocks on the ground, gravel road. But over there, because there's so many shells, they use shells as gravel. I was walking around this, uh, like, um, this, like, nature thing, and they use, like, shells instead of rocks, and they're fancy looking. My daughter was, like, loving it. She's over there picking up the, picking up the shells, <laughs> which I'm sure as, as a, um, like a native, it's probably like, you know, you're a tourist when you're walking around picking up the gravel. But anyway, that's my story. That's all I got. So let's build our road here, and I think we're just gonna go straight to the edge. We can build our that uh, uh, over that way. It's like the exact same. It's 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 essentially it's like it's just like gravel. It's just little shells. Um, it's, and you can even go to like um. You can go to like the hardware store, you know, like so around here you can buy the go to the hardware store and just buy bags of gravel. You can go to the hardware store there and just buy bags of, of shells. Which I think is really neat, and I wanna have shells in my garden. I think it's super neat, but you know <clears throat> I can't. Unless I go I uh, drive my car over there and start bagging up some uh, some shells. There we go. The moat's getting done. We're gonna go we'll probably have to go like three levels down. And, um, yeah, that'll probably be good. Three levels down, and then we'll start, actually, we may even hit Aquifer down there, but we'll start digging, uh, and get, um, get our moat built. 
Excellent question. Which weighs more, a pound of gravel or a pound of shells? <laughs> the world may never know. Okay. Now, as far as um, I mean, my military is back, so we might as well let them go and uh, and and do some um, some some stealing. I could wait until the moat is done, but that is um, not very cobalt-like. And so I say we go and get it now. So let's go steal something. So we are living uh, here, and we've got there's some dark goblins over here. They don't we don't know who they are. Uh, I guess they do know who we are because we're peace. So they know who we are. There is a there's scourge bewitched. There's a hundred of them there though. I want to find something that's got a little bit less that we can maybe find something worth stealing. I don't know, like. I wish we could. That's a parchment scroll. Uh, I guess that's a coat there. We could try to find something that's that's not just a um, like a book, you know. Where's this? Where's this pointing at? Um, an obsidian slab. Is that here? What's it called? It was a staff. No, no, it's not a staff. It's a short sword. It's claim. It's held by the no, the kobold necromancer. If we go, there's probably a bad idea. But it's at one. What was it called? Nations touched. Now that's the thing I should be stealing. Uh, oh, it's got to be in there. Yeah, what's it called? The stupid bile. Nations touched must must be in here. We could try to go. There's there's not a lot of them there. We could we could go for it. Why not? Yeah, let's go. Let's go raid that place. No no capturing. Just go in there and try to steal some stuff. There's some undead there. Um. But, you know, we're not going to get anywhere if we don't go around stealing stuff. So let's go get over there. And I forgot to name Bingus. Uh, I'm going to get someone who's who's marching off the war here. We're going to get... Um... Oh, Flauber. Isn't it my god named Flauber? Why are you so purple? Are you dead? Let's get um, old Tolbus here. Tolbus, you are now Bingus. Okay, Bingus, go get him. There he goes. There goes Bingus. Fl yeah, Flurber or something like that. <laughs> that's right. That's right. That was the god. I was thinking maybe we need to do some sort of like um. Uh, I guess I'm hooked on spires. I was thinking some sort of spire to a god. But we've I built a pyramid before with obelisks, and the one before that was a big glass tower. So I probably should ease up on the towers with the door fortress. So I'm trying to control myself. We're not gonna do oh because of the water. We'll get that um, eventually. We'll get those dug out. Connect all that stuff up. It'll be kind of dangerous. We may we may lose some kobolds here. But um, you can't have a fortress without breaking a few kobold necks. I think that's how the saying goes, anyway. A globe. Oh man, that would be great looking. That would be incredible, wouldn't it? A globe. We could have like. Oh, that would be. Like like um, Epcot. <laughs> It'd be incredible. What happened to all this over here? Clear that stuff out. Oh, before I can't get over. Oh, yeah, we can get over here. I don't know. We don't want any. I need. We need to be nice long jump there before we get everyone killed. That and a little bit of that. We'll probably just, we'll connect up to that guy. We need to go one more here. This way. What's going on? Oh, they've returned. And we got migrants. We got a lot of migrants. Ah, look at that. Okay, okay. Alright, 
Let's go see how they did. Okay, here's a report. I don't see uh, uh, anything about what they got. So we attacked the Avalanches of Savagery. Uh, Dylan led the attack. Defenders were led by a, a Necromancer. Um, we outmatched the Cobalt with a cunning plan. So we surprised uh, old Dolger. Cobalt Necromancer fought with uh, with us. Well, defeated the latter, escaped unscathed. So they defeated us, but we ran away. We didn't get anything. Okay. Well, I like your spirit, uh, but I want that. I want that sword. I want that sword. We'll give you a little break, but then you're going back out there. Now, does anyone know? Is there any like downside to attacking the same place, raiding the same place over and over again? Will, will they like catch on um, that you're raiding them? Yes, these are the, uh, yes, take no candle. I could probably cut into this, this water spot right here and it won't really do anything. We're going to go one more level down. Uh, actually, I'm going to go ahead and remove the, uh, this way. I'm going to go remove all those so it's a, so it's a sheer cliff in there oops what we'll to put it we'll have to leave a couple of them in so we can get back out of there but we'll smooth it all out we're good and then we're gonna dig one more level down and we'll move like let's we'll do a couple of them here in fact actually probably the best place is gonna be like well we need that to be sheer don't we so We'll do one over there, and we'll do one over... Ooh, they're quick. Um, there and there. Just so they have a way way back out, you know, for now. We'll, we'll adjust it in a minute. <clears throat> yeah, world's fair. <laughs> yeah. I don't have any reason for any of their hovels uh, yet. If we get more guilds, though, we'll build them their own little houses, their own little huts. <clears throat> um, we'll probably need to get, soon we'll have to get more, another, like, living hut before too long. Okay, it's actually looking all right. Let me go and uh, do some more, more digging. <laughs> uh, Commissar Cody, thanks for the sub. Thank you very much. Flatten all this stuff here. Try not to get ourselves killed. Some fighting going on. What is it? There is uh, just something. Hunting probably. Yeah, we're building a moat. That way, and we'll come around here. Do you know that whenever, um, what is that? Oh, my, my, ca my caverns. I forgot about my caverns. I knew they were in here somewhere. Um, we shouldn't cover those up. Let me, let me put in a wall here. That, we'll put it out of, uh, like, microcline, and we'll erase this middle one here. There we go. So, we don't want to, we don't want to cover up our mine. <clears throat> anyway, do you know that whenever you, uh, when you dig a moat, you have to do it, um, by shovel. You can't use any, anything electronic to dig a moat. Because if you do, you end up with, like, you get these strange designs in in the moat, like smiley faces, and and um, <clears throat> it's the strangest thing. And the reason is because if you do that, you end up with an emote. Sorry, I created that one on the fly. I apologize. <clears throat> you can't make a moat with electronic equipment because then it'd be an emote. That's that's my uh, attempt at a 
at a um, on the fly dad joke. <clears throat> Um, oh, more spiders. Hey, all right. And we have a baby. Is that? Maybe not. Grown to become a child. I don't know. Oh, he, he was a baby. Now he's a child. Child cobalt. Cool. Mm, there's lots of fish in that pond there. I'm going to go ahead and get my, my bridge set up in here as well. Uh, we will make the bridge out of something exciting. Um, we want it to raise that way. And we want it to go... Um, I guess that's go like... Oh, because that thing's in the way. Mm, okay, so let me... I can't really remove just one little bridge, can I? I think I have to delete the whole thing. Uh, I don't. I think I'd like it to be a, a drawbridge. Um, that may not be very cobalt-like, though. So we we can live without having a proper bridge. We'll make it out of. I'd love to make it out of of shells. I need ten of them. I only got eight shell blocks. I'll tell you what. I I'd love to make it out of out of uh, bones. Uh, what's my work order here for uh, for shells? We got still working on that. Let me get... There it is. Shell blocks. There's only two. Keep, like, more than that. Um, keep, like, 50 of those things around. What's my uh, order here? Oh, yeah. Uh, if it gets less than, like, 30, whip up some more. We got tons of shells around. We might as well be using them and making them out of something. I have a little cobalt village with a glass and neon bridge for the excitement. <laughs> uh, oh, we got a human visiting us. Human? Uh, triplets. Krogus gave, gifts gave birth to triplets. And the human's here to visit. There he is. Hey, buddy. You're so tall. All right. Uh, let's, let's go on another adventure. We know where we're going. We're going here. Spurt folded. Because we want that stick after the human and shave him <laughs> if he wants to join me I will I will gladly take him he's so tall he's got to be like a, a god or something it's giant what are you stuck down there you're not stuck down there you can you know maybe you can't get out uh well while you're down there why don't you dig a little bit more uh in fact uh let's remove remove all these things while you're down there and then we will uh we'll work on getting you out of there okay get your moving good job who is that uh N nasa humans are good for juggling and stuff yeah yeah uh, that, that's the same rumors i've heard it's raining filth Grigus has become a peasant. Oh yeah, was Grigus a baby, and then and then has grown up. Yeah, there, there's Grigus right there. Grigus, good job, buddy. All right, uh, my my people have not returned yet. I'm a little worried. When would they come back? Pretty quick. They may have all been captured. <clears throat> Ice man. Uh, well, I'll give you I'll give you this fella down here who, who we just talked about, Grigus. Who is now a peasant. You are one year old. And you get yourself a name. Iceman they call you. Iceman. I'm good he says. Uh, uh, are you good at. What are you good at? You're, you got a sense of humor. Musician. Singer. You no know combat skills. You're, um, you're good. You actually are good judge of intent. For being one. That's impressive. Can I give you a, a, a job here? Would you do good as, as as one of these fellas? Galder's a skilled leader, which Galder is, who are, is already leading our tribe. 
Let's get another one in here. And you know what? I'm going to let the one-year-old, Iceman, get in there. Dylan's in there. Uh, I guess Galder is... We should do another squad with Galder in it. Maybe we should not... Um, we'll leave Iceman there. We need one for Galder, because Galder knows what they're doing. And build a squad for Galder. Oh yeah, I can't always forget to do this. I can't do it while they're while they're away. Mammals has has assumed the position of the pit boss. Uh oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, they have returned, but it's not a good sign whenever that happens. Are they coming back? Oh, they're slowly coming back. What happened? Why did why everyone they came back? What happened? Mammals just like get out of everyone. I'm in charge now. Are we? Uh, oh, maybe we got ranked up. Pit boss. We were we had a pit boss before. We now have we had a horde keeper. We had a schemer. I don't know what's going on here. Uh, anyway, we're gonna let our head speaker is going to be. Grand Master Ambusher. That's something to be proud of. Um, speaker, speaker. Comedian, um, you are competent in a lot of things, so... Cholbus! Oh, you're the, you're the, um... Ah, it's okay, you can lead. You can go to church and then come and lead us, I suppose. My healer is going to be... Cholbus also? We'll let Jlinkus do that one. My Master Schemer... Is going to be Sturbus. War leader. Leads the raids and such. No one really knows how to do that. Um, Galder's already got a job. Horde keeper keeps track of stuff. Which is going to be Rackath. I'm not sure why that changed. Why that all went away. War leader. We're going to give it to um, Naza. Who hangs out there in the, in the uh, pits there. And also lead the war. We had to go get these. We had to reassign all this stuff. And they actually want stuff now. So I think we we must have leveled up something. So anyway, let's go see our report. How do we do? Back to Spurtfold. And, and uh, Dylan led it. Um, Dylan's planning was superior. But they had a uh, um, positional advantage. Um, we ripped off a right foot of somebody. That's something. We had to run away, though. We didn't get anything. I guess we're going to go somewhere else. I'll have to go somewhere else. Find something. Is he still down there? Yeah. Okay. Um, I will get you out, buddy. I don't want to put stairs on this side, though. I'm going to get them out of there. Can't get out of that. If I put a if I put a channel, they're gonna they're gonna get um. Here's what I'll do. I don't want people to get out of the water. I'm gonna do this. I guess we could we could we could dig it out and then um. Then we'll just tear it apart. Here you go, buddy. Get out. Oh, he's sleeping down there. Okay, we'll, we'll get him out of there. You see the enemy ripped off one of our feet? Is that what it said? Oh, wrong one. Uh, what was that? Spurtful. I'm not sure which one it is. The Cobalt Necromancer, his right foot was ripped by the by, by Trogus. Trogus. There's Trogus. There's Trogus. With a fine earring. Okay, so we've got a new squad here, and we're going to appoint it to our Master Thief, Galder. Galder's going to lead this squad. Galder, I want you to have the Anything uniform. Uh, blue is good. The Lambs of Panting. And I'm going to assign a few folks with you. And so you're going to be kind of like the um, 
just a few of you, I think, is what I want. Not, I don't want a whole bunch of you, just like a few that can sneak in and, and steal some stuff. Uh, Iceman is a master thief who could use his own squad, but for now we'll leave it like it is. And then Trollger. And we'll do one more. So just four of you. Let's send in Sturbus, Master Schemer. So the four of you are going to be my, uh, my, my schemers. Hey, do village. Hmm, yes, defeated. That's right. That worked. I got you out of there. Yeah. Okay, we'll we'll tear that up now. Actually, I guess we'll we'll tear it up in a minute. It's two levels down. You think enough? Or should we go one more? It's pretty quick. Let's do it one more. I got you a staircase. Why can't you get out? Maybe you don't want to get out. I need like a autofill channel button. Should have left one of these open so we could just uh, climb out of here real easy, but um, we'll get our guy out of there. Then we'll have to connect this thing up. Okay. And then while you're down there, well, we'll, we'll figure it out when you get there. Okay, did you make your way back out? Looks like it. Okay. Child bit by a phantom spider. That'll give you nightmares. <clears throat> I didn't. Okay, 50 blocks. Means we make our bridge now. But bridge I mean just just a wall or a, a floor. <clears throat> uh, we'll go like that, and we'll make it out of them blocks. We got two hundred of them. Apparently, I had more than just the fifty set up. Uh, we may put in a. Oh, you know what? I want I want to put in a wall there also. Like that. Well, I don't know. We can a wall looks good, but if if they have to climb over the wall, we can like shoot them and push them off. However, we would also get pushed off the wall. It may not end well for us. But they can like jump off and stuff. No, we'll put a wall up. Let's do um We'll do it like that. Make it out of out of the um the shells. <clears throat> of course it menaces with spikes. What else would it do? Okay, then I want you guys to come in here and I want you to make it look nice. Uh, I forget my... There it is. Can we just smooth it? No, we can just engrave it. Engrave everything. That bridge to shine. got some some people that aren't quite as happy as they were before let's see what what the problem is there is um you're just you're reading a book trollger here what's wrong buddy not that uh you uh mm, thoughts feels wonder remembering performing the rites of the cerulean sect in a dedicated temple yeah you've got a temple what else could you possibly want enjoyment fondness bliss well what's the deal why are you not so why what's with the uh the grumpiness
I learned about the nature of belief. It's wondrous. You got nothing in here saying that you're mad about something. You just enjoyment, interest, content, fondness. What's the deal, buddy? Where's that smile? There we go. Someone left their whip laying around. Okay. Do we not have a... F oh, there's no... I thought it looked funny. Here we go. Okay, scarf complete. I'm going to try to send out these... The, the lambs... I don't have a... a well, let's set the lambs up real quick. They can come in here and do the thing. Um, actually, you know what? The lambs, they can have their own barracks. I got extra space around here. Let's give them their own spot. Let's build their own shell place. And um, we're going to put them, we'll put them next to these guys, I suppose. I don't need a big place, just a little place for these guys. I want to look as, as hovel-like as possible. We hovel. Uh, we want a ramp. Okay. We'll give it a roof. Uh, we'll put some beds in there. They can sleep in there. Um, it's. We might as well put... I got only got one bed on that side. We could put some, a few more beds over here, so then uh, that'll free up some space in the uh, in, in the den. For beds, anyway. What if I were to do something like that? Look, we can still walk in there. Yeah, we don't really do meat. Um... We have plenty of food. We just don't have any meat laying around. We've we got meals, so all the meals are made of meat. They'll be fine. Um, and then I think I can still get in here. Um, I want to go. I'm going to uh, channel it down like I did the other place. Because I think it's a cool effect. Um, and then we'll have to we'll have to smooth it out a little bit because it's a little too small for compared to the other one. We'll leave that one. A sunken floor, yeah, yeah, just like like this one is over here. And uh, while it's sunken, I'm gonna go ahead and get a floor in there. And um, I kind of like the look of the dirt. But we'll put we'll put some shells down, just like Florida. Okay, I can't. I don't think I. Uh, I think I've. If I put them there, I don't think I can put them on the ramps. So we'll see that. So then we can mark this thing as a door, as a uh, as a uh, a barracks. And this will be my barracks for the other squad. Uh, the lambs of panting. They can do all their stuff there. And then we'll give them a bed and all that kind of stuff. Because so they can be fancy. Hey. Oh, no bed because it's um, no roof.
It's not going to work, is it? Um, Now we have a we will have a hovel. A proper hovel. <clears throat> there you go. My hovel building's getting a little better, if I do say so myself. And I believe they yeah, they can get in there just fine. So now it's underwater. We can go get some uh, some beds. And we'll put a couple beds over here. I got one bed, so we'll make one bed. And uh, we'll give them an armor rack and all that stuff which we gotta make. So we will make some things. So I would like, um, you are the one that makes, this. I can make bone beds, I can make shell beds though, right? I can make a few things cool out of shells, well, all my, all my gear, of course. Um, it was, it was in the, the shell crafts. You can make all kinds of stuff. Well, some things. do it here. I forget what it was. Um, oh, it's only bone weapon racks? Hmm. Well, we can make them out of car carpenter shop. Make a couple beds. And then we'll get weapon rack and an armor stand. And we'll throw those inside there. These guys already have the armor stand and weapon rack. They need to cut another bed or so. <clears throat> It'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. For some, for some reason, dwarf beds have to be made out of wood. Seems like it would rot often in a, in a cave. Okay, so... Why is this getting channeled? So what happened to our, uh, our channelers? We can make it there now. What's the deal? I think we can. What's the deal? What am I what am I missing here? Down, down. I think it's okay. Oh, migrants. More migrants. We got 47 in here now. And we got a weapon uh, a masterpiece weapon rack. Okay. Here, let me do this. Okay, and then um, we'll do two of them. Oops. <laughs> Guess we're done with the moat. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. Yep. Uh, the mode is the mode is done. Um. <laughs> slowly fill up here. The cobalt down there. Get out of get out of there. What are you doing? Oh, they were cutting that out and they fell in. Okay, it, it'll be okay. Is there not a oh, I need to put a wall there. Quickly. I 
think it's it. So that's there. I uh, I guess it's the floor there. I guess it's fine. It's it's at that level, so it's okay. Um, good question. We have a lot of a lot of migrants here. Let's see if anyone has any new um has any uh, new animals. We have a, uh, a new cave rat. We got a, a modern lizard and a cave rat that came in. I mean, what was the order? Did we buy those. Uh, Barubas here, the spider. We have a oh, we have a bat. And what are you, a worm? What is that? There's our bat. It is a uh, a Gila monster hatchling. Well, while that is going, um, Cerulean sect requires a temple and a high priest. I thought I got one for them already. Is the Cerulean sect not who we just built this temple for? Is this, you want another one? Oh, you want a, oh, you want a temple complex? 10,000? Okay. Well, we're gonna have to grow then. He is no buttercup, that's for sure. That's for sure. Um, first off, we will channel... This isn't really what I wanted. We'll try to carefully channel this thing. And over here... Uh, and, and that one, and uh, that one, and, and that one. I'm not gonna end well for these kobolds. We may have some. We may have some don't that don't make it. It's going in there now. Um, you okay there, buddy? Naza, what you doing down there? Naza, let me tell you a dad joke. It'll make you feel better. Um, I think I just saw one. Let me see. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Um... Why do fish live in salt water? Because Pepper makes him sneeze. Oh no! Nah, nah, Nas, get, get out! <laughs> we may, oh, we lost a monitor lizard too. Well. <laughs> you know, it's... It, yeah, you always have those sacrifices, you know? You never know what's going to happen whenever you start digging these moats. You get some bad pepper jokes. Uh, <clears throat> what does a train eat? Or, how, sorry, how does, does a train eat? It goes choo-choo. Oh, boy. Where do young cows eat lunch? This is a good one. At the cafeteria. The cafeteria. <laughs> he just couldn't take the joke. <laughs> Okay, he's done some some digging. Good job, buddy. Do a little more. Yeah, there you go. All right. Whoop! You just fell in. Well, that's Naza. Who was who died then? You have to swim, buddy. Who do we lose? Let me follow you. No, no, no. Follow. Him. Oh, you're fine. You just swam out. Okay, no problem. Not much of a moat. What I needed was a volcano. Okay, that's all been cleared out. Uh-oh. Plursness. Plursness is dead. Oh, Plursness. You were the best. Never forget you, Plursness. I don't know who you are, but I'm sure you are great. I should, like, change this and put the bridge over here. In fact, actually, um... 
Oh, yeah, I still do that bridge, don't I? Because if they want to go on a, on a raid, they always go over this way. This is where we're probably weakest because of uh, this. But we got these cages set up and all these mechanisms, which I was trying to set up before as, as some cage traps. So let's set up some cage traps. Um, traps. Cage trap. Something like that, just just to make sure that one's uh, secure. Let me throw some over here, just to keep out the filth. You know, humans and the like. Mm, our monitor lizard, our monitor lizard is is going as well. Um, okay, no, back back to our uh, our new guys. We're gonna send them on a little little mission. And we've got a, uh, oh, the Monastery of Festive Chaos. It has some things. Let's go get it. Send the new guys in. Yeah, go steal stuff. They're going to go over there. And then we've got a hamlet, nothing there. There's a castle over here with some things. Let's go steal from the castle. Alliance, Alliance, Schmalliance. That's what we say as kobolds. Let so you want to ally with us, you have to accept a few things. Thing one being, we're going to steal your stuff. I have five seeds in this fortress. Are we eating them? Mostly we're just eating fish. Fish is, is, is our diet here. Fish and uh, we have some traps set out for some bug catching. Uh, oh, you know what I didn't think of is if they want to come trade with us... Um, this isn't wide enough. I should have done a three wide. I, sh I don't think we they have any wagons. They're kobolds. I think the last time they came was just the small one. So the the lambs are back. How do they do? What did you guys get? Searched around and you looted um, Sanctuary of Shields and Dream Dishes and Beyond. Or maybe it was just and beyond. A couple new things. This is going to be, we, need, we have a mighty temple here. Which we need to um, make it look real good. 10,000 is a lot. We're going to have to put something exciting in there. Something worth a lot of money. Do we know the value of these things? No artifacts. I need to get an artifact. I need that, I need that sword. I need that sword. Oh, the eviscerated folks have returned as well. Went on a raid to the castle. Defenders were led by a human. Cunning plan. Attackers had a strong advantage, though. Um, clashed with 25 humans and killing 10. What? Dylan is a hero. Omo happened upon them. They fought. They fought unscathed. Human uh, Nelty. His left ear was ripped off by uh, by Stumus. Nelty's right ear, left ear and right ear was ripped off. Good. Get the ears. Stumus was forced to retreat. Um, Enid confronted and uh, was struck down by Thetis. Radir was uh, confronted and struck down by uh, old Jalorsner. Fresh punches, Jalors nor fresh punches. That's the kind of names we need around here. We have now out. Uh, we have now made enemies with the humans. Uh, it's okay. There's only ten people there in this tomb. Okay, as soon as they get back, we're going to that tomb. What is that? Humans. Phantom spider silk. Oh, some clothes. Humans. Humans. Uh, did we get anything new out of that? We. Oh no, we didn't take anything, did we? What was that all about? No. A rainy company, a ranger guild's been established. Ranger guild. Okay. Well, uh, the only thing I really know to do to make this stuff look nicer is some um, pedestals of things. We can make some more statues. I got a bunch of them over there. They're not worth that much, though. 10,000's a lot. We're gonna have to get, get some, some pedestals and, and, um, about all we can do. Pedestals. 
Do I have that many? I've got what? I can put. I got two, two pedestals. Can you make um, make bone pedestals? I don't. Know. Oh, there's shell, shell pedestal. I uh, apparently I don't know how to spell pedestal. Uh, make me six of them, and we just gotta go steal some stuff. So this ranger guild wants to live here. We'll give him a we'll give him a spot. I'll make this wall just out of whatever. And we'll stash them like up. Um, if we if we do, um, we could put them right here actually. Kobolds cannot get fey moods. No, that's that's one of our downsides. Being kobolds, we can't get any. We can't make our own artifacts. We have to go and get them ourselves. We have to go steal them, which we are failing to do. With um, forty six of us, we probably start getting attacked here pretty soon. Make some roads. Just because we're cobalt doesn't mean we're not uh, uncivilized enough to have roads. <laughs> Do that. We'll go one up this way, and um, stockpile is kind of in the way for that one. We'll get one over here for the fishermen. Okay, so our rangers are going to go in here. Uh, we'll set them up as a meeting area. Guild for Rangers, the Rainy Company. I forget what they want there. They just want it's a thousand bucks already. They just want to. Um, we can probably put a couple statues in there. Statues of gloves. And then we're gonna need to get a. Uh, that's our first death, isn't it? Um, oh, what's his face? So we need to get a slab made. I don't, know if I'm, I don't know how to make slabs. Can I make it here? Can I make a slab of some kind? I don't know how to make slabs. We don't have... We don't have their body. We can't make it there. Um, mechanic and a loom. I guess I'm going to have to get a... Uh, did I make a stoneworker shop? I thought I did. Make a slab for all what's her face and we'll put them somewhere. Now, again, this. We can put some things on these slabs. I got more uh, pedestals here. We can put stuff on. There was a masterwork stand, wasn't there? I think that's it's not going to be worth that much, though. There's a nice bucket. Some nice cages. A cage with a spider in it. These aren't that fancy. I don't know. Something I know of is we'll put the armor stand on there. 
That's not that's not really worth much. We got we gotta find we're gonna go steal stuff. We thought we'll need a solution here to fill that with stuff, stolen stuff. What's the value now? Only a thousand. We can smooth those walls. Uh well. Oh, we can smooth wood walls, okay. We could actually floor it. That would do it also. Uh, we could change our floors here. The shell, I think those are those are shell floors. We've already carved all that stuff out, but if we put like, if we find some metal, we can do something with that. Make it nicer. We just need to go steal, I think. Put those sticky cobalt fingers to work. What do they want in there? Just value? Yeah. Give them a chest. And it probably would be a good, bad idea to put in a little bit of flooring. And we can just... Um, we can, we can uh, um, engrave it. Just floor that one in. So those are done. We'll engrave all of that. What is what is that? Statue of cobalt, but there's a spider there. Microcline statue of cobalt. Items in uh, image of cobalt and microcline by Old Grolbin. Kobolds are traveling. The artwork relates to the foundation of Wander Snarling and the Curious Bites by the Carm Snarls. That's us. But why is it... Why is it a spider on... I'm so confused. Giant cave rat. I can see... Oh, it's like... It's off. Weird. And this one is of blood gnats. A statue of blood gnats blood there. How are we looking? Not quite there. They're gonna need something valuable as well. All right, so that answers the question. We go for what we need to do. We need to go steal. There's a hundred of them there. We gotta find somewhere small that has things we can see. Six thousand goblins there. Lots of monasteries. There's a fortress. There's a hundred of them there. In pursuit of the path of the moon. I'm going to try this one one more time. Spurt folded. I haven't had any luck with it, but we're going to have luck this time. What's the trick to getting rid of these? I forget. Uh, was it... It's... Smoothing? believe so. Yeah. Okay. As they're all away, I'm going to go to the bathroom. We are back. Just give me just a minute. I will let it uh, kind of play out here for a minute, and I'll be right back. Give me just a second. All right, is that Cobalt wearing like a red dress? Oh, they are because they probably have a red dress. I was make. What am I making? Yeah, skirts and shirts and robes, headscarves. You can see the headscarf on them. Everyone has a headscarf. Oh, is, oh, that was a hunter's guild. That's something different. Okay, we came back. Let me see how we did on our excursion. 
Nothing good. <clears throat> We fought, ran away. We do, we have tactical planning superior, but we just cannot get, we can't get through them. Shell lords, but that's me. Looking for something that has, what's that? Something, something that's valuable. Having trouble getting into those, into those towers. We could try sending. This one, we're at peace with this one. We could try sneaking into that one. Problem is stealing from towers is always risky because you don't know what you're gonna be bringing back. Yeah, and it's it's. It's defended well, and 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 there's and we're not really the best of fighters, so yeah, it's going to be tricky getting into that place. <clears throat> so we have a uh, ranger guild and a hunter guild that wants wants in here. We got rainy company wants a guild hall, which is the ranger guild, and we have oh, these are the ranger folks. Yeah, I forgot that one, and then the hunters. Yeah, we'll do a hunter one as well. I don't have anything valuable really to to give you. Uh, Hunters, I'm gonna put you up on top here. You climb up here, and you can you can have the the upper the upper floor. Mm, yeah. Guild hall for the hunters. Migrants. 53 of them now. That should lead us into something. Yeah, we are a village. We were a, I think we were a hamlet before. A Crafts Cobalt Guild has been established. What's with all these guilds? I can't keep up with them. Well... Craft land is over here, so maybe the crafty guild should be living in... That's food land. Where's craft land? Over here? Maybe they should be living over here. Let's do some... some. Oops. Didn't need to do that. This was our, um, our shell stockpile, which actually isn't, so it doesn't really matter. Let's just set them up over here. They can live where they do the crafting, you know? Eh, it makes sense, doesn't it? Cobalts. Not the prettiest. Guild hall for uh, crafts kobolds. That one. And again, they're gonna go, they're gonna want value, uh, which they're not gonna get unless we floor it real nice. And I will select the material. By real nice, I assume it means shells. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, we do have a mad person. What's the deal with the angry person? Corsness. What's 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 the deal, buddy? Uh, embarrassed sleeping without a proper room. Uh, bored with having with having an intellectual discussion with an acquaintance. Angry, dwelling on getting in an argument. Loathing, dwelling upon talking to a pillar of society. Angry, getting into an argument. Loathing talking to a pillar of society. Loathing talking to a pillar of society, like my uh, my no, the nobles. I may not have a good place for you to sleep because there's a lot of us here now, so I probably need to get another uh, another place to sleep. Let me go ahead and get the stuff I was meaning to do before. So the beds and a couple more beds over here. So if you're in the military, you've got a bed you can sleep in. Uh, I got a weapon rack and all that kind of stuff. We got to get moved over. Weapon rack, and I have a, uh, um, whatever the other one was, um, armor stand, there. <clears throat> There's the crafts cobalt, which we've got set up. Okay. 
Now, I was thinking about having to do... Yeah, I think we need more space over here. I have my offices ideally over here, which also, also, I have all this. So, um, when you want, we need lots of offices. Maybe tables and chairs. I don't see... There's a musical instrument right there. Hey, the boldus. I forgot about the boldus. Is it worth anything? That bold is up there. Okay. We could always throw in a few more beds. That would keep a few of them happy. But I think we might need to expand our uh, our, our hovels and have a hovel, like, um, set one up over here. Like that. It's gonna be a dormitory. Uh, kobolds don't care. Like dwarves kind of do. Like that. And we'll just throw in a whole bunch of uh, of flooring. In fact, we'll give them a we'll give them a nice floor. Oh, you know what I want to do? I want to do the Go down, because I, I like the look of that. <laughs> How many narcissists does it take to screw in a light bulb? One, the narcissist holds a light bulb while the rest of the world revolves around him. expand this zone just a bit and throw a few more beds in there I'm not sure why the military ones are are in there I think I have you guys set up to sleep in here don't I do I not uh, I do I'm not sure why they're sleeping over there <clears throat> um, you are, yeah, eviscerated confusion, and you're the lambs panting. I don't know. Okay, now back over here. I want to go and and we're gonna remove some of these some of these ramps. A were skink has arrived. A large skink, twisted in humanoid form, it's crazed for blood and flesh. Its eyes grow violet, glow violet. Sandy Trump taup. Sandy, taupe scales are jagged and close set. Now you will know why you fear the night. I'm just trying to build some, some of these things. Where's this guy at? What? He's a moon? Oh my! Look at that guy. I haven't seen that art, that before. What are the chances he's going to just go and like step on one of those traps? Now this is where we have a problem. We have no defense. Uh, we have to just sort of fight it out. There's going to be a wear skink problem if we don't fight this out successfully. So we're going to grab everyone. And we're going to go move them to stand here. And hope that he gets... Where's he going? Who's that? Run, mammals! Run! <laughs> He's too fast. I can't. Mammals is, is is going at it. Mammals is dead. That was quick. Okay, okay, okay. I need a. Uh, what are you going? Uh, okay, burrow time. Let's set up burrow. I always forget about burrows until it's uh, until it's attack time. Ideally, everyone kind of stays in the center here, actually. Mm 
And then if you want to go up here and go to the go to the library, you go right ahead. Um, I should include the the um, oh yeah temple as well as you are welcome to the temple. So. Okay, uh, that one, uh, it's going to be just like the home zone. And we're going to assign uh, everyone. And it is not paused. Uh, I don't want you going and getting things for your, for your stuff. Okay, so everyone is back. Where are you guys going? They're grabbing their gauntlets. All right, whatever. Do whatever you want to do. Um, where is he? How'd you get up there? Did you jump across my river? Oh, he's going to get the animals. The animals are at it. Oh, there goes the cobalts. Okay. Um, I don't know what we're going to do about this. It's just going to be bloody and bad. Um, Tarok has assumed the position of the, uh, the pit boss. As there's lots and lots of fighting. Did we get him? I think we, I think we got him. We got him. Oh, who is this? Zoalak. Elf sweat. Ah, oh, dang elves. So there's Claiborne's foot. Who was in that fight? I think... You're injured. You're injured. I think only the two of you got hurt. Old Sliligan, the child. How you feeling? Your body's cut open. You're dented. And then uh, Srolber here um, is cut open as well. And her liver is bruised. And you have you have the blood all over you. The others, I think, I don't think we're actually in on it. So just those two. I'm just gonna. I hate to do this, especially since you're just a child, old Sliligan, but uh, you're out. I forget how to do that. Uh, I, I'm going to boot you out of the camp. Um, anyone remember how to do that? I forget the uh, the, <laughs> the way to do it. Um, there it is. Can I not boot you because you're a child? Okay, I'm going to kick... Srolber out. Yeah, sorry, Srolber. I mean, I could, I could like... Well, hang on, you know what? Why don't I just lock you into somewhere? And then when the time comes, you can go nuts. You can do whatever you want to do. We've got a nice pit here. Uh, I can build another one. Let's, let's put you somewhere. So you can just go nuts. Yeah, um, the parents have to go. If I do that, I don't know. Let's quickly whip up a little home here. And then, uh, I think doors are fine for werebees, right? They can't break doors. I'm pretty sure. Oh, I'm not gonna have the walls in. So let's go, let's go dig that out. We'll put a roof on it as well. We do our, we'll do our ramp thing. Throw a roof on it. Claiborne's dead. Mammals and Claiborne. There's not a lot of named folks in here, but the, the ones that are named are, are dead. And remember the names, so we've got... I'm gonna, I'm gonna name you. Um, you are uh, you are the Ware child. And then we've got... It wasn't Harley, who was it? And I hit spacebar and, 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 I, and I missed it. You remember who it was? I'm gonna go to the med bay, so we'll find it over there. There they are, Strollber. So Srolber is the um, 
is the worst geek. Okay. Alright, we can destroy doors. Hmm. We could just lock them in there. There's a skink. Oh, there's a snake in there too. Once I get done, we can just lock them in this this little home over here. Uh, let me close my burrow. And we'll um we'll we'll lock them up. We got some mechanisms. We can build a bridge and close it up just fine. What are you guys going to get? wood. We have to just keep on keep an eye on the date. As long as we get it locked up before um well we'll see what happens in the first time. You know? Let's do that. They may not ever come out of the of the place. Bridge we'll put right there. Uh, and then we'll put a lever. The lever can be in the main the main place over here. Oh, well, use all my mechanisms up. I need um oh did my manager die? Why did it reset everyone? Why does it keep doing that? Wait. I don't have a manager. Wait a minute. There we go. Okay. I, okay whatever. Uh, um, I want... We're just doing them out of wood. Or, um... Oh, we're making them out of... We have to be out of stone, I think. Rock. Make a bunch of those. Hey, Skull. This is Steam. This is Steam version. They are out. Out and about. Running around, running amok. We've got a half a season here to get this done. I mean, he's getting step stepped on and not finished, so let's make sure we get these, these done. And then we gotta get a, a floor up on top. So let's throw a floor down. Like that. Why is the bridge keep getting inactive? There it goes. Okay, so now if those mechanisms are getting main. Which aren't. Make, let me just do a task for one rock mechanism. I might need a couple of them. What's, oh, I'm out of rocks. I'm out of rocks. What am I going to do with these guys? They're going to go nuts. Uh, here, whip me up a couple doors. We're just gonna set up a little a little place in here. Um, like that. Uh, no. uh, Omega. Okay, so this is uh this is this is where land. They might be able to break their way through, but I guess we'll find out. Um those assigned to wear land, which doesn't matter yet because we gotta get a door. Okay, 
We have plenty of time, but for the sake of, of um, you know, making sure that uh, it works, we're going to throw Srolber here, our miner. And who's the other one? Uh, old Shilgen. Can go over there. And that bro should be active. Yep. So they should go in there. Once they get in there, we're going to lock the door. They can hang in there for a month. They'll be fine. Assuming they make their way in there. Nothing can break doors or gates in this version unless it spits lava. Oh, really? Okay. Arkad has opposed a ban on things. So I think what's happening is we're, we're leveling up, and so it's like changing us around for some reason. What's the ban? Export of bracelets. Everyone needs all this stuff. And I haven't got all this stuff set up yet. Um, the trader is going to be old Cholbus here, and the healer is Cholbus as well. Schemer. Uh, Galder. You can do that as well. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to set up one of these. This office should be set. It is set as Racketh. Take it off Racketh and put it back on Racketh. And then uh, this one over here should be Terox. And that should also be a bedroom, right? They want a bedroom too. For Racketh. And over here can also be Bedroom for Tarok. Okay, how are you guys feeling now about that? You, know, you don't have your tomb or your chest and all that kind of stuff. And Galder and Cholbus want some stuff as well. Galder needs something, and uh, I already just used up Cholbus' spot. Okay. They haven't gone in there yet. I get a little concerned because it's getting kind of close. Turn that off. <laughs> yeah, they're going to go uh, lose their mind in a minute. There's the rare child right there. Playing with the dang boat. Who's your parents? You don't care, so don't ask, says the were child. Uh, you dang were child. Put that boat down. Oh, I can't kick out Magna and, and Bingus. I can't kick them out. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Why don't you go in your burrow? Snatcher? Goblins! Oh, I don't think so. Go get him. Oh, the enemy is here. Oh, humans are here. Humans and their dogs. Okay, so uh, uh, cancel, cancel that order. All right. Um, well, they're gonna come in here and they're gonna they're gonna hit us right as the uh, <laughs> right right as the were beast hits. Okay, Strobel here is listening to the music. Where's skinking away? Um, I should put Strobel. If you're not already in here, I should put you in one of these squads. Strollbur. Get in there. And then, where's that child at? Oh my God, I can't put kids in there. Maybe they're old enough. No, I don't think so. No. Okay, so now... Uh, I'm going to inside a few more people here, actually. Anyone have any skills? Uh, Droder knows how to handle a sword. I don't have a lot of weapons. Slinkus knows how to fight. And, um... Stony knows how to handle some stone. 
Slurbus and uh, and Korsness. Okay. Now I need everyone in their burrows. All the civilians in there. Turn that one off. Okay. So that's, that's on now. Where are you guys going? Where are you going? No job. Well, then get back inside. Can't you see there's a siege on? Where are they? Ooh, there's a bunch of them. Oh, no. And they brought their horses. <laughs> they brought a lot of horses. Uh, uh oh. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Well, let's get... I'm hoping these guys will get equipped in seconds. Uh, most of them have s something. Uh, I would like you guys to go and stand here. Please. Okay, so now... Zoom out a bit. Here they come. Oh, they're riding their horses. Trying to act all big and tough with their horses. Well, we'll see about that. And he's laying siege to the fortress. Let's see about that. They're gonna they're gonna just mow through us. And there is old Jalorsner is just on a mission. Oh, Jalorsner! They're gonna write songs about you, buddy. You just like scared them all away. Where is that guy? I lost him. Where you go? There he is. Jalorsner. With two lovers. He's 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 faint. He's got some bleeding. He's a little tired. There you go, buddy. But you did good. You did good. They had a whole mob coming at us. But Jalorsner said no. Not today. And they, they just sort of scattered. What? Are they running away? Oh, Jalorsner. <laughs> okay. Well, we gotta make a statue of that guy. Okay. Jalorsner, you are a hero. Uh, let's go and cancel the burrows. Not that one. And we'll cancel the orders. Well, let's get to some statue making. I don't have any rocks. Oh, yeah, I got tons of rocks. I guess Lignite isn't a, a rock we can make statues out of, is it? Yeah, I can't make it out of that stuff. We gotta go find uh, something to go mine here. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, it's right in the middle of the base. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh -oh, oh, no. Well, Sluggan is dead. That was the kid, I think. Where's Srolbrat? Oh, he actually went to his burrow. Oh, good. Lock the door. So the kid didn't go there, but he did. He might have, might have bitten a few folks in the process. Yeah, he bit a lot of folks in the process. We're going to have a fortress of, of were skinks. Which, um... I may or may not be opposed to. Because if everyone's aware of Skink... How you feeling, buddy? Unconscious. Your hand got cut open. Neck got torn open. They do look very cool. There's gonna be a lot of dying... If we can get a whole a whole fortress of these guys, like the Hulk, he's he all he's left is his pants. Come on out, buddy. Get your clothes back on. Get out of your burrow. Yeah, I think we're gonna we're gonna go for a wear skink fortress. I think that's our only hope now. A lot of blood up there to the north. Where we find those rocks at before? 
Microcline nut doesn't count as um, something we can make stuff out of. Let me. Maybe because it's maybe it's just because this is full. Put all that lignite in there. Uh, I don't really want lignite. Let's let's change that, and just kick the lignite out. I'll solve that problem. They should grab that microcline, bring it up here. I don't know why it says we don't have access to it. I I thought you could make microcline statues. Needs non-economic hard rock. Lock him in the hospital. Yeah. You know, we're trying something different here. I think we I think we go out uh, with in a blaze of glory here. What's that? Hematite. I just want too low, isn't it? Maybe we can get into our uh, our thing. Actually, we don't even need a stairway. We can just do um, ramp. I guess he's already on it, so we'll leave it. Yeah. Oh, that that's why we couldn't get to that stuff. I mean, that, that fixes all of it. So we can make... That was everything. Statue. And we can select what we want to... Oh, no. Another statue. And we will select... This statue is going to be a image of... Um, Jalorsner. Oh, there's 1,500 Jalorsners. Which one isn't? This Jalorsner is a... Is a um, a were beast? Is a troll bridegroom? What? Not a were beast. Troll bridegroom. Um. What? What's? Who's the one that died? What's his name? Jalorsner. Uh, Drillgerlaren. Okay. Drillgerlaren. There he is. Fresh punches. You, buddy. And uh, I'd like it to... Um, top priority, buddy. All right, I, I, I might mess that up. That one. Okay. I want a statue of you, buddy. And the camper, caravan's arrived. What's, why, why aren't we doing our, um... Oh, there's threads. Something about the... The empty cage. Oh, I don't have to... Oh, these are animal traps, not cages. Oops. Uh, we can make them out of wood. Make ten cages there. Here comes the caravan, crossing a bridge with their giant rats. Everyone survive here? Uh, we lost the one, so we will put in, anyone have any skills in fighting? We got Jammin, knows how to handle a mace. All right, so they're arriving, and I'll trade with you. I don't remember what I have to trade to sell. Uh, I've got a bunch of animal traps. I guess you can have all those. I'm not really using them at the moment. Right, we have tons of food. We can sell you a couple of food barrels. Um, bins of what? Bins of boots. Bins of... Oh, yeah, hives. I forgot. I was going to get some mead made. Uh, I got a lot of books. I 
think I was selling masks, wasn't I? I must have, I must have sold them all. I've only got a couple left. Whoever, whoever Drudus is, we love him. We're going to make more statues of him, I guess. Table, threads. Mm, that's silver whoops worth a thousand bucks. We need to put that on our in our temple. Okay. Um, let's do that right now while I'm thinking about it. So here on this stand right here, we're going to put in that whip. Okay. It's not going to be anywhere near what we need. We need 10,000 and we're at, what are we at, like two? Yeah. So we got a lot of stealing to do. So, I will give you all of this stuff, which is worth what? A thousand bucks? Um, what do you got? You have a bat and a rat. I'll take a boat. I don't have any drinks. Mm, there's a bronze short sword. I do want that. Some, I'll take some bronze weapons. These are like picks. Some dirks. I'll take those. Uh, um, staff. I may not go for this. Lots of cheese. some paper. Okay, will you take that? Ah, good, good, good. Okay. A dad joke. All right. Let me see what I can find you. I'm the fastest animal in the jungle, the lion roars. The cheetah shakes her head. I don't think so. Let's race and see. The whole population of the jungle shows up. Elephants stand next to gazelles, rhinos, and hippos, hippos line up. Hyenas and zebras and every other animal wait to see the outcome of the race. The lion's very confident he will win. The race begins and the cheetah takes off. She wins by a mile and is declared the fastest animal in the jungle. The lion's embarrassed and can't believe he lost. You're a cheater, he shouts. Yep, and you're a lion, the cheetah replies. You're a cheater. Cheater. <laughs> um, what did the doctor prescribe to the sick lemon? Lemonade. You're a cheater. <laughs> <clears throat> Speaking of uh, uh, cheaters, we're about to have a. Um, is that are we at full moon or is it, is it going the other way? Has it been that that quick already? It may have been. Let me go uh, clean up some of this stuff and make that into a new bedroom. We've got a lot. We're gonna have a lot of of wear skinks. It's gonna be a real problem when these guys show up here. Um, it'll be interesting. won't end well. We got 49 of, of us in here now. Oh, look, he finally decided to go in there. No, you're not You're not that person. You're some other kid. Never mind. We do need a, uh, a room for... Uh, Galder and Cholbus both need one. Also, are you guys are both making... You're both making demands? All right, so we're going to make three chairs. Yeah, I need the laugh. Yeah, the laugh track. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, I know. 
I know. I don't know though. What what what's funnier, the uh, adding a laugh track in, or just just the silence? After telling the dad joke, <laughs> what do you think? Okay, here we go. Here it is. Okay, so we got how many of them just turned? Four of them just turned. There's one, two, three. They do look real cool. Uh, four. That's a corpse. I'm not sure what number four is. Yeah, laugh tracks are terrible, which is which is why it's perfect. Oh, up here in the temple. So there's gonna be a lot of a lot of biting and vomiting and all that kind of stuff. Um, gonna be some deaths. Oh, lots of deaths. Are they shooting webs? Skink shoot webs. Oh, the spiders. My spiders are shooting webs. He's gonna put a, a big damper on the old uh, the old animal. Um, farm I've got going here. There's, there's, he's just chewing through so many of them. Brambus. Oh my. He just killed everybody. <laughs> I, I knew kobolds were weak. <laughs> oh man. Well, the mandate has ended. Oh, man. I guess I should have known that was coming, but... I thought maybe someone would... Someone would survive. The spiders survived. Man. Okay. Uh, Brobus is mad. Bingen's mad. Tarok is still alive and he's happy. That was a little ugly. A little uglier than I was, than I was, than I was hoping for. Ooh. That may have just ended our fortress there. I was uh, as 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 well as we did before. You know, we we ended up with like what two deaths before, a lot of bites, but only two deaths, and that that time was nasty. Man, all right. Well, um, we we'll got a lot of bodies here. Let's uh, set up a stockpile of bodies. We'll throw them over here somewhere. That'll be our corpse stockpile. Ooh, that's rough. And uh, I don't think we're coming back from that one. Harley's still there, but everyone else is going to be injured. Harley is injured, and uh, and Thetis is injured. I mean, it's everyone else has probably been bit. I did notice a couple of our fighters though were hanging out down here watching in a demonstration, so they did not get hit. So we got these three are in good shape. But everyone else is 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 uh, been uh, uh, chomped on. Animals, you still out here? Your bones still out here somewhere? I don't see you. Um, well, one final uh, moment of glory I think we can do here, though, is we can build a statue, a very important statue. But right here, um, right there, and that is the statue of. Where is he? This guy? That's not him. Unless his name is different than what it was, what we saw, what we saw before. It's supposed to be. Where's, where's the statue I was supposed to be making? That one. Is that it? Oh, it's of. Uh, oh, it's of a goblin and Jalorzner, the kobold. Um, so oh, this goblin is raising. Jalorzner relates to the abduction of the kobold Jalorzner from pant dusks by the goblin. Jalorzner got abducted? Is that the right Jalorzner? I think it is Fresh Punches. It must be him. And then he escaped, I guess. What a story that guy had. That's why he was so brave. He charged out there against all those humans. There was like 30 humans out there. And he charged out there all by himself. He, uh, he wasn't able to stick around for the great uh, <laughs> genocide of the kobolds. But he did good. He did good. We'll get Brubus in there as well. Man, we got whooped by that. Um, 
Oh, you know what? Everything would be great to visit in, in adventure mode. Where's my statue at? Is he, is he pulling it in here? I think I just saw him haul on it. Man. That's crazy how... Um, I guess I should have I should have assumed that was gonna, gonna happen. I didn't send the military in. Um, I didn't want them to like immediately kill the were skink. I was hoping they would just like you know go for a little bit of a tussle. The were skink didn't seem to be doing anything before, but um, well, they did this time. Where are you taking that guy? Oh, that was the, that was the caravan. Oh, we got 15 cobalt now. And, um... 6,000 cobalt uh, goblins there. Man. Um, let's see. Where is my nobles? So Dylan's still a war captain. We don't have a um, a war leader yet, which we'll give that to. I'm gonna let kind of most of the stuff fall under. Uh, well, I guess we'll get. I guess Brubus can do it. He's a he's a warrior. Horde keeper will be uh, not Dylan. Um, Thidus. Let's see what happens. The skinkening. That's what it was. That's what it was. We never got our beds made. We did we did get a bunch of silk cloth laying around. There's one bed, two beds. I think that's moved out either. I think my miner probably is dead. Yeah. So uh Harley dabbles in it. Harley, you top wood, you you mine things, and you also are a doctor. Add that to your list of things. Another full moon coming up here in a second. So we'll see, we'll see who, who is left and who survives. Difference between a well-dressed man on a unicycle and a poor-dressed man on a bicycle. What's the difference? Attire. I think that was one of the... What, I think that might have been my very first dad joke that I told. One of the early ones. Early, early ones. Good stuff. Put these. What are you doing? Putting the key traps in there? Okay. Well, bomb is the boy, the billiard. Okay, there it is. So Thidus has turns. All right. Who, who, how many, how many turns? So we got six of us have, have turned. Six of fifteen. There's gonna be a lot of biting going on. I think everyone else is just gonna die. But if anyone survives, they will be a were beast. There's three have died. Oh. We're down to four. It doesn't, it doesn't include it was just we got three babies and Trogus. Hey, magical hack, thanks for the raid. You scared me. He's out here. Don't go back there. And he's dead. Nobody lives in the fortress right now. <laughs> the mandate has ended. Okay. So we have three left. And they're all were skinks. We've got Thidus, Schleilus, and Korsnus. Did Harley die? Harley was the only one I knew, that I knew of that was um, a skink. Oh, and they got all the animals as well. Oh, man, it all fell apart so fast. Just just the moment I started thinking, uh, I started thinking that um, we were going to get somewhere. It all went downhill. The three kobolds, they're all very angry. The statue still hasn't been built. Uh, are any of them in the military? Nope. Um, it's 
get a uh, we want a war a war leader. Thidis. Okay, no more painting, just these three guys. If I could send them away, like if when we see the moon is almost here, we can send them away. I think we can. I think we time it right. Is that? I think that works right. If we could send them away as they are away doing where beast things. I don't remember what day it is that it hits. I think we could time that. So I knew Fortnite I had a necromancer doctor. My first wave of migrants. Oh, nice. Uh, we got we got some missing folks. They're probably in the water somewhere. They probably got thrown in the water. Yeah. Oh, he's right there. Okay. I don't know how we missed that one. Well, I'm gonna see. I'm gonna try that and see if we can we can uh, um, do some some raiding like as as it. Um, as the full moon hits, and see if we can get it to where they're, they're, they've turned as they arrive at a fort somewhere. I think, I don't think it works that way. It didn't used to work that way, but we'll see. Yeah, yeah, that's the cure. Is you, just, you, just, you uh, as soon as they die, you resurrect them. That's the necromancy cure. There's a lot of spiders and, and rats in this fortress now. Let's get that statue placed. It's raining revolting filth. I, you know, I saw that before and I was curious about that. I think maybe it's what maybe it's because I'm a kobold that it does that. Because we were close to these goblins, but we weren't right on them. So I'm wondering if that's because we're kobolds. It's, it does the filth now. New moon, we're halfway there. Magical hack. Sure, sure. The mightiest cobalt. Well, there's only three of us. So. Magic. Magical hack, right? Magic. Is there a K in there? Magic. Hack. There we go. Magical hack. Thanks again for the raid. <clears throat> and thanks, Harley, for being on being on the shout outs. If it's gonna happen is we're gonna get some migrants in here, uh, and then the first full moon, it's gonna be biting time. That's another idea, I guess. If you, what you could do is, if you get were beast in your fortress, and they're running around like that, um, add them to the military, and then just send them away. Send them to like a long way away. This is a small map, so no one, nowhere is too far away. Like it's, it's what three days travel to way out this way. Um, but we could try, like, time it to get them out of the fortress. Make sure they're out of the fortress. Tattoo's dead. Um, so they're away as, as the, the moon hits. But I think I think this is where we, uh, we call the fortress done for here. Sadly. Was it dead? Uh, he's he's in um, where skink form, isn't he? Dead fellow there. There's one over here too. Oh, he's all bones now. Mechanism has been made. Oh, look at that! Still getting some work done. Good job there, Thidus. Problem is they're kind of mad, and so what's going to happen is they're going to be kind of cranky. And they may not listen real well. And they get webbed also, like that guy is. I think it happened around the first. So, is the first always where the moon cycle is? I don't think it's always that way, is it? Let's wait until the 26th. And then send him away. Let's go get. I'm gonna send him far. And I sang hogs. Um, yeah, let's go there.
Okay, so get them get them out of here. Get out! Get out before you turn. Get your sticks. Get your gear. And, and get out! No, I didn't make it in time. I <laughs> didn't make it in time. We're gonna go chew on all the animals here. No, so much, for, so much for that. I got, like one of them. They had to go get all their gear. I should have set it to where they just have their stuff on. Well, I think one of us made it out. Which won't do any good. That's hilarious. What happens if I... If I retire here, does it... I'm surprised it doesn't uh, uh, say your village is dead. Because it hit zero. So he's going to run around and chew on some things. Are they back? Yeah, they're back. But now they're... Uh, now, they're now he's away. So Korsness is somewhere around here. Where is he? What, you get stuck in a trap? You get stuck in a cage trap? Well, we'll, we'll get out. <laughs> um, I don't know how I can get you out of there. Okay, get, get out of there. There you go. Okay, he's out now. I don't know why, why he was... What were you, oh, what were you doing? Wait. What's in there? There's something in there. There's a cobalt in there. Corsness, there he is. And who's that? Plorsness. Oh, he's a ghost. Okay. Yeah, so he's stuck in the cage. Well, we'll leave him there. He's gonna sit there and be real mad. That's what he gets. That's what he gets for being a werebeast. That's right, he's safe now. Okay, they'll be gone here in a few they'll be back in a few days. Unless they get captured, then we're done for. Which I'm pretty sure we're done for anyway. But we'll get a report here in a minute. When the inviscerated what's her faces will come back. And that, I think, will be the end of our mighty kobold hovel. All due to a wear skink and me thinking, um, it's all because of that, that kid. Because the one was in there. It's that dang kid. I could have kicked out, like, two of my old, my original folks, but I didn't. Uh, what are we doing here? Oh, we did, we got stuff. Did they do it? Untitled is not there. They must have gotten something. Uh, the pleaded outrage of an unknown civilization. So we still... We, we got in there. We searched around. We still... I sang hogs. And we still... The grasping animal of quakes. And also Untitled was stolen from there. Good job, kobolds. Uh, I wouldn't know what those things are. I wonder what, like... What the untitled thing was? That? There's the nice saying hogs. This is a giant cave rat parchment scroll made of nice. Written on it is a story entitled An I Saying Hogs, authored by a Gooker. No uh no particular subject. The writing skips around a lot and it's somewhat showy. The prose is not awful, but not good either. I'm gonna let this guy out of here. You are uh, you're free, buddy. Um, I think if I get rid of the cage, it'll get you out. Which I'm not sure how to get you out of there. I think we can come in here and just remove uh, that one. Point it 
now we now we've got two cobalts left and we can go and get that stuff stolen <clears throat> well i think i think our uh, our game of of cobalts is it's done for I, I hate to break it to you but i don't think there's any salvage in this one I hear the howling as we speak. I think that's if if anyone has done it where you can you time your uh, were beasts on an expedition. I know I've tried it before in the old version, and I can never get it to work. Um, but if anyone's ever gotten it done, let me know. I am curious if it's if it's possible. Oh, is that the one we want? Is it right there? Um. It's locked. How do we get this guy out of here? Ooh. You you build it right. Can we construct a cage? That one. Yeah, build it and let him out. Yeah. Problem is, we're all busy um, uh, sparring at the moment with some, with some ghosts. I'm going to... You're off duty right now. What's with the sparring? We're going to wrap it up here. Well, farewell to the uh, the Cobalt Fortress. I enjoyed it. While it lasted. Always overwhelming if you don't catch the first one. Yeah, um... It's tricky. It's real tricky. And yeah, that, the only thing I've... Um, like, you can, you can let them go. You can kick them out of the fort, but then they just come back and fight. Um... You can. Oh, there's an elf visiting us. Um, I think the best way I've I've found is is to burrow them away and then lock them up, and just lock them in there forever. And that's that's probably the only way I've found out that really works well. Skinks are out. I'm gonna go chew on that elf there. That's a good. That's a good finale, you know, chewing on an elf. That's oh, he, the elf killed it. What? That's not not cool. There we go. Are we gonna get him this time. Okay, we got him. Got him this time. That's a happy ending. Every time the, the bees come out, the animals just like take off. It's kind of funny. Adam smash him. Oh, it doesn't count as I didn't know that Adam smashing doesn't count as a killing, so it's not a loyalty cascade starting thing. Ah, interesting. Interesting. I guess did he not ki did he not kill that guy? I guess not. All right, let's uh, let's abandon this fortress. Uh, we'll retire it for the time being, and then we're gonna come back, and uh, we'll just we'll just take a look and see what happens to our fortress. The workplace accident. We'll throw, um, I was like doing legends mode and, and, uh, just like building another fortress, building it advanced to a couple weeks and just seeing what happens to our, to our, our people. In the, it was called the something soul, dimensions of soul. That's us, I think. Atom smashing is a good way of, of cleaning up uh, if you have some sort of frame rate problems as well. Good way of keeping the place somewhat clean. I'm going to build a fortress and then we'll come back and look at it just to see what happened to those three. I should have named them something so we can remember who they are. They may be living happily ever after there in their wear skink days. Or they may be out terrorizing the world. So we are there. 
Uh, it does say it's still working. So let's just, let's embark kind of nearby. Um, sure there. Um, I should do a normal little startup. Let's see what we can find. This was an interesting start because we had so many kobolds in the world. There wasn't, it was like a kobold empire. Two, I think there's two of them, right? It's two kobold empires. Interesting start. I miss, this makes me miss um, the um, the masterwork mod. Such a good mod, which adds in like this. We we did the fortress with uh, we did an orc fortress. Um, we had one where we were like demons, imps, and uh, like succubuses and incubuses. Um, you do a human fort and help you an elven. I don't think I've ever played an elven fort actually. Um, was there goblins? I think you can do goblins on there. I don't remember what it was. But, um, oh, so many good things in there. And I, I hope it's still, uh, there's some life there with it. I'd love to see it. With uh, the Steam version. I built, one of the ones I remember... I made a, a an orc fortress, um, and I made my I made like a like a stockade, like a fort, you know. And I think a dragon came by. I think it was a dragon. Something came by. Something fire breathing came by, and started breathing fire all over the place and burned my fortress down. <laughs> like one, just it didn't like we killed it pretty quickly, but it just everything burnt. The whole map burned, including my uh, my my whole fort because everything was made out of wood. Um, and um, I did um, I did a couple of them with with like succubuses and things. I don't think this is working. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, it took so long. This is a. Uh, Oh, we got, I think we got a, I think we got a buggy map. Yeah, we got a buggy map. We can see, like, weird stuff going on around. What is going on here? I don't know. I don't want to hit, sp oh, yeah. What is going on? The water's all going to go splashing in there. We can, if I hit space bar, it's going to, what's going on? Sections of the cavern have collapsed. This is a weird, a weird bug. It happens every once in a while. It's happened twice now. Like we're in the caves, but we're not in the caves. Yeah, one of these again. If I had space bar, it's going to like freak out. So I'm not going to. So I'm just going to abandon this fortress. And then we'll go back and look at our, our uh, uh, legends mode. If it lets me. Yeah, surface cavern. Last time I had it was... It was even weirder than this one. We, like, saw adamantine already. If I hit spacebar, then all the water effects start happening and it just freezes. Weird bug. But it wouldn't be Dwarf Fortress if there wasn't a bug. Or two. Or ten. Mm-mm. <clears throat> So uh, we'll wrap this up um, if this saves. We'll give it. A, we'll get a few more minutes. We may not get. Uh, we may not get. <laughs> we may not get our lights mode. But we'll wrap this up here in a minute and uh, and call it a day. And a little early, a little too. Um, not, um, not enough stream time left to get into a different game. So we'll wrap it up. And I'll be back here tomorrow. And we'll play, um, we'll play something else. I think it's gonna work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, errors all around. Let me see. If we were to pull this up, let's see. I just want to know if my kobolds went on a rampage and started, like, chewing on people. That's all I really care about. In uh, the soul one. 
Next fortress. I don't know. What, what, what should the next fortress be? I, I had... Um, I did that other world where I had... Remember, I had, like, few dwarves in the world. And I was going to... Um, I built the, py the pyramid one. And my goal was to build multiple places. So I may need to go to back and do that. And see if we can build, add on to that world. Um, I don't know. So I don't think we're going to get much... In foot, wasn't it? I don't remember the name of my place. Um, does anyone remember? Pant Dusks. Um, if I type in someone like, um, that's sites. If I go to something like Harley, oops, and they'll tell me where they lived. No. What was Jalorner? There's so many of them. Fresh punches. So I'm curious about this guy anyway. He was born in 142, youngest son of Stringus. So when, as a child, he's abducted from paint dusts by a goblin. And he was imprisoned by the monsters of neutrality. He settled in there, and then he ran away. He, he was there for 80 years. And he ran away. And became the next year he became lovers with Bulbus. Became a ranger in Pant Dusks. Is Pant Dusks where I started? Or am I, is that my place? I don't think so. Uh, and then they broke up. He gave up being a ranger, become a carpenter. He became a member of the company of Mor Moral Mortality. We should be two fifties where we're at. Um, lovers again and broke up again. And um, oh, and then, and then met Gaylor. Cult of Holes. Became a thief operating out of Pant Dusk. There's a figurine was stolen from here by Jules. Oh, you stole you stole a, a figurine, huh? Brought to Pant Dusk. So that's what you did. You gave up your carpentry job and you became, went to become a thief. And then you stole all kinds of stuff. You stole a ring. You stole a ring. You stole an earring, an amulet, a bracelet, all kinds of stuff. And then in 250, I think this is me. You settled in sneaked dipped. I don't know when you showed up with me. Settled in Wander Snarling. That's that's me. Wander Wander Snarling is what is me. So you let you you finally you married Dorber, and then you left all these things, and then you came to Wander Snarling, which is me. So Wander Snarling. Curious Bite. That's me. And you fought in the crazy assaults, uh, which is where I sent you. I sent you a spurt folded a couple times. Uh, you went to Flare Squared. The eviscerated confusion led by Dylan clashed with 25 humans and killed 10 of them. That's where his confidence came from. And then you met Radir. And you struck down Radir in Flare Square. Good job! And you came back. You became a, a member of the Rainy Company, which is a bunch of rangers, I think. Uh, rangers are hunters. And you had another attack on Spurt Folded. And, um, you fought in the siege, the Searing Siege, they called it. And then you bled to death, slain by a human, Isun, with a battle axe. What a story. You got one kill. Plus, uh, what's her face? Uh, you, well, you killed Radir in that fight, and you also, uh, killed someone in Flare Square there. Um, so I want to look at the Wanderer Snarling, where we want to go. we go. Oh, look, it's blue. Okay, so we all settled in here. And then... Here we stole things. I don't think... Yeah, we're not gonna... Because no time has passed, we're not gonna get anything after this. Which is a bit of a problem. There's not really any way of doing that unless we unless we can settle without it going nuts. That's not what we do. This, this is two weeks worth of time. Volcano Temple with a Lava Moat. I haven't done really anything with, with uh, lava this time. Okay, I haven't done any magma forges or anything like that. Um, I haven't done an ice, an ice fort. Might be kind of cool to try. Let's go somewhere like, I don't know. Can we go somewhere here in the sand? 
I'll make a tiny, tiny embark. Most likely for things to be weird. Focus on making some religious zealots. Yeah, that could be interesting to try. Like, like focus all in on, on the temples and whatever. That could work. This one works. So let's retire this one. And then we'll go back to Wander Snarling and see what happens. So two weeks have gone by. We could also, uh, I could have sat there for 20 minutes, which I probably should have, and let, let like a month or whatever go by. Unicorn Glade Forts. I haven't done anything with uh, like terrifying yet. Um, I tried to do haunted, and it didn't work out very well. Yeah, you can get uh, you can get volcanoes and icy biomes. It's rare, but you can you can get them. <laughs> um, I've always wanted to do a fort where I like. I dig straight down and start building in the caverns. I've done a bit a, a bit on my own. I've never done it on like a stream. And it's, it's just kind of hard to, it's hard to make anything like, the caverns are such a crazy like looking place. It's hard to get uh, anything of that looks breedable down there. If that makes any sense. Okay, so a couple weeks have gone by. Anything else new, new happened? Um, nope, just some folks visited, but it didn't say anything about people going nutso. Let's look at Schlalis. Can we look at Schlalis Shlal Mystery Tuft? There he is. Mystery Craft, the Grasping Animal of Quakes, Fimo Cobalt. She bit the elf, passing on the skink monster curse, and then struck down the elf. And that's it. We haven't gotten far enough, far enough time. Yeah, you could do custom. Yeah, custom world gen could certainly get it in there. So Wander Snarling is is still kicking, but it's only been a couple weeks. A lot of folks visited and got probably will get bit here in a couple more weeks. But yeah, let's let's um. See what we can do here. So de uh, detail mode is kind of neat. There's all kinds of stuff you can change in here, and um, like a million things. And there's there's you can make your own, um, and like save them and make some pretty cool uh, stuff. And there's some really neat things that people have done on um, that you can find online of some really nice looking maps. Um, I don't think nothing nothing is in here, but um, I should go look and see if I can find some things. But that's for next time. I don't know. Well, I'll have to come up with something. Somebody has something. Somebody has some good ideas. Let me know. We'll we'll find something to something to do. Something out of the ordinary. What a tiny world. Age of the Bronze Colossus and Mountain Titan. What a tiny world. I love how tiny it is. There's tiny little... Uh, there's there's dwarves. We've got elves. We've got a volcano and some goblins. Perfect. I want to I wanna keep it. <laughs> but no. It's bedtime. Posted stamp world. Mm -hmm. Alright. I'm going to bed. Thanks for hanging out tonight. Uh, I will be here tomorrow, and we will play something else. Um, I'm not entirely sure what, but we'll play something. So, uh, thanks for hanging out again.